how would I go about creating a column here? What I do is I'd use a rectangle command, and this is automatically going to draw from that 2D point, so I know it's on 0, 0. As far as the Z plane goes, I select this, and I'll extrude it the distance that I want the column to be, which is 8 foot 6. And now, if I come here, I can see that that is a column. And if I don't want to see all those lines, I can come here, and it's the U and V ISO that's showing up, and I just want to make those 0 and now it just looks like a regular line and if I click on one of these corners let's highlight this first and then click on one of these corners you can see the line so here's a column I can block this column if I wanted to if I'm modeling and I'm doing something that's a more finalized model I could do that I'm just gonna copy this and copy it from this point to this point to to all the points where there's a column that's in the view. Like I said before, when we model this, all we're doing is modeling things that are going to be in the view. So those are the four that are in the view. Let's go ahead and save this real quick. Let's go to isometric or this tab here and it'll allow me to go to the view manager. In this view manager, I'm going to adjust it so that it's not a parallel view. I'm going to do it as a perspective view. And in here, hit shift and using the middle mouse button you can rotate and now I got a little bit of height to set up my view and I want to set up this view so that I'm viewing pretty much like that so I'm going to see the building the openness of the building and also how it frames the view of the horizon or this great vista that's part of this property so there's that basically from here this building is fairly square so using that extrusion command either going to navigate to the different views you can extrude in the different directions and you can get your beams you can get all of your interior stuff you can get your site from the loft command that we showed you after you've mastered all that stuff you're going to get to a point where you have this drawing which is this model 